Hi ladies, it's Karen and I found something I think is really cool. I've been going through a couple of um, shelves and I came across this old like mixed media book that I did a long, long time ago. Look, the date on it, 2005. And um, this is back before, well, before I knew YouTube existed and you know that there was even a crafting community out there and I remember when I did this I had gotten the idea from I think a creating keepsakes magazine um, I'm not sure but anyway what this is is a big see I never finished the back <laughs> it's one of those big board books you know for a child and what I did was I peeled it and then sandpapered it um, it and I did that to all the papers or pages very very tedious and um, And then I sanded all the pages because I didn't know about gesso <laughs> and then um, and then I guess I, I painted it and it came with this hole in the, in every page You know, there's this little window and it the book came like that. I didn't do that so I thought it would be fun to share this with you because um like I said, this is 2005, what is that, five, eight, eight years ago I did this, and um, it's just kind of funny. <laughs> so this one, I titled this one Shadows Family, because I knew I wanted to make do a book about my family, so I titled it Shadows Family, and there's a picture of Shadow, and um, a lot of the pictures that are in here, I, you know, Messed with them on, in my Photoshop, and there's some magic mesh there. These acrylic um, sticker letters or whatever. I tied ribbon around here, and see, I papered just part of it, and all this is paint. And I stamped this using um, paint, you know, my sponge stamps, um, whatever they're called, and paint. So this is all stamped out with paint. And my label maker, which I've always used that everywhere. So that's the cover. <laughs> and so there's a page for each one of us. So this was Joe's page. At, at the time, he was playing poker a lot. And um, he has a motorcycle. So I took bits and pieces uh, for each page, you know, that would suit each person's personality, you know, like um, what they were into and this and that. So um, this was Joe and, you know, motorcycles and the poker. This is paint. It's a little bit of papering there and motorcycle sticker. Look at these old pictures. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. <laughs> Billy Bones, he um, has always done a lot of fishing. Not so much this past year, but um, yeah, so that's what that is. This is some of that twill tape. I remember that. Um, and this is, I had him write out Ten things that he loved about, or five things that he loved about me, and then on my my page I put five things that I loved about him. But you could see I, I painted the background, I painted it, and then I would sand it, and then paint it again for like a layering effect. You know, to me that was mixed media. <laughs> and there's some netting. This is like a netting up here. So yeah, it's just cool when you look back at you know what you worked with and stuff way back when and this was my page and, and this was a long time ago I'm in my we had just gone for a motorcycle ride I'm in my motorcycle jacket smoking look like a tough old broad I don't know why I put that in there <laughs> but um yeah incorporated stuff from the beach <clears throat> you know, shell stickers, and, um, you know, I did my name here, and then these are those letter beads that you could still find at Michael's and stuff, and um, I did that tearing effect and layered some papers. This is all paint. This is some old jewelry. See, I've always used old jewelry. This is some old jewelry that I had just adhered in there, and some stamping. Am I showing it okay? Am I... Um, yeah, <laughs> and then this page, 
Um, and there's my five reasons why I love Joe. Um, this was an old card and like a greeting card and I just thought the image was cool so I inked it up and laid it here. Um, this is more magic mesh here, my label maker and fibers. Um, this is a this picture was taken, I had done the Walt Disney um, half marathon a few years back and um, that's me wearing my medal. <laughs> yeah, so this is, and I, I remember I went over everything with Mod Podge and the pages stuck just a little bit when I first took this out. Okay, this is Spencer's page. See how cute he was? Well, he still is. Magic Mesh. Here's a, a dictionary definition. Oh no, this is just a piece of a, this is a, a newspaper article. He had won an award for something for his uh, Parade of Patriotic Banners contest and his artwork was hung um, along, um, hanging along the main road in St. Lucie West. They made it into a big banner. So he had won that. So that's a little newspaper article from Spencer and he was into skateboarding and stuff like that. This is a label from the, you know, body spray. He likes the, that Axe body spray. And see, I painted using different brighter colors for the boys. Um, I used the Joker deck, or the Joker card, because, you know, he's always messing around. He made me laugh. <clears throat> he was 15 at the time. So cute. He loved animals. Still loves animals, but, um, <clears throat> he's always had an attitude, so I stuck that there. <laughs> so that was Spencer's page. <clears throat> and this is Logan's page. Look at this. He was 10 years old at the time, eight years ago. How cute, cute, cute. <clears throat> and um, Magic Mesh. This is a little bit of screening, screen, metallic screen stuff that Joe had gotten. I forgot where he got that and he gave it to me. So I've always used stuff like that. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, Logan, it says temper here. He had a temper when he was younger. <clears throat> Excuse me, always into computers, so I stuck this little piece of electronics there. This is one of the twill ribbons. This is one of those shrinky dink with um Woody. He's always loved he always loved um Toy Story. Um there's another picture of him. He loves music. He's always been smart. This is a little piece of his blanket that he carried around for the longest time. Uh. This is so cool to go through it, you know, all these years later. The background is paint, just a little bit of paper, and I tore it, and then I painted it. You know, red is his favorite color, so I used red for him. And on every page, I tied these ribbons. I hope I'm showing this cool. And then this one is just a, you know, me and Joe together, and then Spencer and Logan together, but... This one, I, I painted it and I inked it. I remember doing this. I, uh, back then, it was only walnut ink spray. And um, I remember going over this with that. And like, this is tissue paper right here. And I adhered that with Mod Podge. This little bit of tissue paper. Um, these little word beads, or letter beads, I've always used those. Um, see how I altered the photo in my Photoshop? And I used those little pieces of cork um it's like sheets of cork and i used to cut them apart and then stamp a stamp use my letter stamps and then make my own letters uh this was probably way before thickers <laughs> but um yeah stamp my letters there made my own corks thickers <laughs> um yeah a little thing about coffee here because I love the coffee. Um, and then Spencer and Logan with new skateboards. I messed with this this photo too with uh, Photoshop. Um, my heart, 
keys there, more Magic Mash. This was, sorry, 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 um, keys. This is, I think, Attic Treasures sticker, Magic Mesh. This is part of a real watch right here that I saved the backing and put it in here. That's Magic Mesh, um, Time Flies, Love, Laugh, Live, Learn. Um, these little slide things at one time were really popular. And um, so I used to ink them up, paint them up, you know, use rub-ons on them and stuff. I still have a bunch of those. Um, I put this tool tape here. It says naughty, and then it gives a definition of naughty. <laughs> a guilty, guilty of disobedience or misbehavior, brothers. <laughs> yeah, individually they were cool. Together, oh my gosh. <laughs> so let me, I'm going to show you a, a better look up close. I just thought it was wild to find this. And since I don't have any projects currently happening right now because... Um, you know, I've been spending time with my family. I thought I would share this blast from my past. There's Logan. Cute kid. I had cute kids. <laughs> and this, that was Logan when he was, what, eight? No, 10. This is Spencer, he was 15. He had his long hair, really cool picture. Let's see some of my, uh, you know, mixed media or whatever. All that paint and paper and Mod Podge and my inks. I can't even remember if that's a Tim Holtz ink that I used around the edge of that. If, if, if there's even been Tim Holtz inks since then. If not, then that's, you know, like a regular brown chalk ink. I can't even remember. But, um, and this is my page again. And I did mine in softer tones. I've always liked that soft, um, well, you know, shabby chic vintage type deal. So I messed with a lot of the photos from Photoshop and then tore them and inked them, make them look like they were burnt. Or else maybe I really did burn them because I used to do that, burn the edges, I mean, with an actual lighter. <laughs> used to make Joe crazy. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so, and then the last one, whoopsies, is Joe's. He wrote some sweet stuff there. It was nice to, look how cute, it was nice to come back and read that after all these years. Yeah. And then the cover, Shadows Family. Yes, yeah, so I wanted to share that for you, or, or I'm sorry, share that with you. This is a blast from my past, not only the photos, but the types of embellishing, which, you know, we all have come back to this kind of thing, but, um, but also, you know, a project f from so long ago. It's just so cool. Anyways, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. I'll talk to y'all soon. Probably, hopefully next time with something a little more current. Bye-bye <laughs> now.